Imagine a seemingly insignificant event, a slight cut on your thumb. In the grand scheme of things, it appears to be a trivial matter. However, at a microscopic level, it's a catastrophic event. Thousands, perhaps millions of bacteria, have breached your body's first line of defense, your skin. They are pouring through the cut like an invading army, ready to exploit this new territory. This is where your immune system, a complex network of cells and processes, leaps into action. It's a silent, invisible battle raging within you, a three-dimensional war waged on a microscopic scale. This remarkable system, explored in fascinating detail in Philip Demmer's upcoming book, is crucial to your survival. The first line of defense in this microscopic battle is comprised of macrophages. These are large, amoeba-like cells that patrol your tissues, engulfing and digesting any foreign invaders they encounter. Picture them as the black rhinos of your immune system, powerfully built and always ready to neutralize threats. They roam your body, hoovering up bacteria and cellular debris acting as both soldiers and janitors. This initial response is swift and brutal but sometimes the sheer number of invaders can overwhelm even these valiant defenders. When this happens the macrophages release chemical signals, a distress call that echoes throughout the battlefield of your body. Answering the macrophages call are neutrophils, smaller, more numerous cells that travel through the bloodstream. Think of them as the special forces of your immune system, rapidly deployed to the scene of the invasion. They are short-lived but aggressive, releasing powerful chemicals that destroy invaders and often causing collateral damage to surrounding tissues in the process. This inflammatory response is what causes the redness and swelling around a wound. It's a sign that your immune system is hard at work, battling to contain the invasion and prevent it from spreading. Section 4. Targeted Defenses while the macrophages and neutrophils are fighting on the front lines, a more targeted attack is being mounted. Dendritic cells, acting as intelligence officers, gather samples of the invading bacteria. They then travel to lymph nodes, the command centers of your immune system, carrying vital information about the enemy. Within the lymph nodes, the dendritic cells present their findings to T cells, highly specialized immune cells that are trained to recognize and destroy specific threats. Think of T-cells as elite soldiers, each equipped to combat a particular type of enemy. Once activated by the dendritic cells, the T-cells multiply rapidly, creating a powerful army trained to target the invading bacteria with lethal precision. Section 5. A Lasting Peace This incredible cascade of cellular communication and coordinated attack is just a glimpse into the complexity of your immune system. It's a world of constant surveillance and rapid response, a silent battle waged every moment of every day to keep you healthy. Understanding how this system works is not just fascinating, it's crucial for appreciating the delicate balance that allows us to thrive in a world teeming with potential pathogens. To delve deeper into this fascinating world, I highly recommend Philip Demmer's forthcoming book. It promises a captivating and accessible exploration of the immune system, a journey that will leave you with a newfound respect for the intricate workings of your own body.